Hi, my name is Tim Hardy and I'm currently a student studying computer science at university in the UK. Now, a month and a half ago, I just took my year two computer science exams. And I did the old fashioned memorization technique, which was good old cramming. Basically, a month before the exam, I would look at my lecture notes and look at my own notes and just go and repeat it in my head again and again and again and hope for the best on the exam day. So, two two days ago I got my exam results and I got less than 40 percent on all four exams now less than 40 percent is a fail in the UK it's a really pitiful mark I, I know a lot of people will cram and get higher than that but I I put a lot of effort into cramming and revising and I, I was disappointed I put so much effort and got little in return and so this is why I joined the School of Phenomenal Memory because I will really need to get 60 or 70 percent uh, to get a decent job because you want a first degree or a 2-1 in the UK so I joined the School of Phenomenal Memory and I've been practicing on their software a little bit and before I joined they made claims of you know memorizing an entire book and I thought yeah, are you sure you can memorize an entire book then I thought I've seen de documentaries about memori um, memorization champions, and they memorize 52 decks of cards, and they can do it. They can re uh, recall it backwards. So not only can they recall it forwards, but they can also recall it backwards, which is amazing, and they do it fast. So I knew the techniques were out there because they all said they used visualization, and they all learned it. It wasn't like they were all autistic savants they all learnt the skill and so I was looking for a memory course that would teach me this skill so I joined School of Phenomenal Memory and in two weeks I'm memorizing 60, 60 random digits now that's in two weeks and I'm considered amateur at the moment very amateur and my focus has gone up because of their software that I'm using to increase this um, increase the digits and my concentration but I'm considered amateur because people are memorizing whole books. Some guy on the forum in two days memorized a 126 page book. And so it's, it's fully possible and I'm, I'm really looking forward to it, finishing it this summer, the 60 day challenge. So when I go back to university, instead of spending a month revising, one week of the whole year I can um, revise, memorize all the lecture notes of all the modules. So all six modules I'll memorize all the lecture notes and then that's in one week and then you've got the whole semester to do whatever you want you've got so much spare time because it does stick up there it does you can remember it because it's all through pictures and visualization it's not about just thinking randomly so oh what was it it's, it's actually pictures and visualization and you can just look like you're watching a movie in your mind like at the images and you can say oh that's what that meant and so it does work, and I have experience with it, and I, now I fully believe you could memorize an entire book. And um, I'm looking forward to like going to an Italian restaurant, knowing Italian, and with my friends or a date, and saying to the waitress, oh, can I have this, but ordering it in Italian language. And um, my friends will be like, oh, so I didn't know you spoke Italian. It's like, oh, it's something I picked up. It's not only with phenomenal memory, um, you memorize and you retain it, but you memorize fast, so you can memorize a language within like two months, which is ridiculous. So I, I fully believe in um, phenomenal memory at the moment, and that's only me memorizing six digits, which might be big for you, but for me at the moment, compared to everyone else on the forum, um, it's small. People on the forum have to reach to up to 600 digits. Um, so I, I fully believe I can do it. And I fully believe in the 60 day challenge as well. Like, I'll, I'll be able to do it every day. Um, it's just like uh, building a, a toned body. It takes exercise, hard work, and a diet. Uh, but it's also about the long term goal. So think long term. And uh, it's fully possible. Don't, don't kid yourself. This, this, it's fully possible, and it's fully possible for anyone. Anyone can build a toned body if they put the effort in, and anyone can build a phenomenal memory if they put the effort in. So don't, don't think you're, you, you won't be able to do it, because you will. And I will be able to do it, and I'm going to keep you updated with this blog. Thank you very much.